Coach, <laughs> pansin ko lang parang iba to sa mga tinuro mo sa amin nung huling episode natin. May move to. Ah, so ang tawag sa ginawa ko ngayon mm-hmm. ay anyo. Anyo. So forms. Form. Kung yung karate, may kata, yun yung counterpart sa arnis. Mm-hmm. So combination siya ng different movements. Tapos yun, you're putting it together as a performance or performance. art. Performance. Art talaga siya. Mga kapatid, ang arnis bilang <clears throat> makasining na pagkilos. Ako po si Lourdes de Vera. Ako po si Ardic Tan. At ako si Daniel Bernas. At sabay-sabay po tayong humataw dito sa Usapang Arnis. So, bali coach, art form ito, no? So, yes. unlike kunyari yung sinabi natin yung kata, <coughs> ay uh, may mga traditional set movements yun. Ito, purely improvised talaga. Well, yung ginagawa ko kanina, improvised siya. So, I'm free-flowing, just experimenting around the movements. Pero, ang Arnis, meron din ang mga traditional forms. Mm-hmm. So, in, especially in competition, may mga brackets or events mm-hmm. for pieces that are really traditional. So, gawa talaga ng mga grandmasters or their masters before them. Mm-hmm. Tapos, meron din mga avenues to kind of just put, um, you know, your own kind of take to mm-hmm. it. Freestyle, no? Freestyle, mm-hmm. oh. So, may mga events din na hinahalo nila ng konting wushu, taekwondo, nagbabackflip sila and so on. So, yun din. Pwede namang isali din sa mm-hmm. performance. Kung sa mga titik, kunyari, si Kambal. Mm-hmm. Si Kambal Arvik, no? <laughs> So, parang self-expression yan. So, kanya-kanyang yes, uh, expression ng katawan. So, ikaw <coughs> bilang MMA, train kasi MMA, may sarili ka rin ilalagay dyan sa ano. Yes. Mm-hmm. Ma- sa, uh, so, susuntokin mo yung ano, gano'n. So, parang siyang shadow sparring actually. Okay. It's just less, ano, less emphasis on the combat and more emphasis on the art. Graceful. On the art. Mm-hmm. Oh. Dance shit. Mm-hmm. Pero sa pinipili mong mga movements ba, ay may practical consideration din mo yan. Pero paano? Mm-hmm. Kunyari, uh, kung iniisip mo na pagtagpi-tagpi ng series of movements, yeah. how do you decide which movement follows which movement? Um, siguro, for, well, at least from my experience, it comes down siguro talaga to ex, um, experimentation. Mm-hmm. So, pag nagpa-practice ako, when I'm trying to come up with my own combinations based on what I've learned then from my instructors, yun, titingin lang ako sa mirror, tapos I play around, titingin ako mm. kung okay ba siya, uh, mukha ba siyang um, applicable for our niece, mm-hmm. and so on. So, it's really a matter of trial and error talaga. Trial and error talaga. Alam mo, speaking of trial, Coach, baka pwede mo kami turuan. Definitely, yeah. Basics. So, we're gonna learn some anyo. Game. session na to, we're going to be learning anyo. So yung anyo, ginagamit siya sa competition as performance. So you're putting together the different movements that you've learned in our niece. Basically, um, sinasama-sama mo yung iba't ibang mga kilos, techniques, movements, and putting them together in such a way that you're displaying a mastery of skill, you're showing your technique. So important dyan yung fluidity ng movement, yung form, speed, power, kasama din yan. As the word niya, anyo, it's all about form. Okay? So I'm going to teach you a few steps, that's what, yeah, we'll put them together for one entire piece. Okay, so try natin. We'll start with our basic stance from a while ago. So right foot forward tayo. Stick here in a to position. Left hand dito lang sa chest. Okay. So ang first movement natin, if you recall yung basic strike natin, di ba diagonal strike? Gagawin natin siya dalawang beses. Ang tawag yan ay doblete. So it's sure is one, two. Two circular strikes to the top of the head. Let's try that out. Ready, and doblete. Move. One, two. Come back. Isa pa. One, two. One more. Move. Doblete. Galing dito, we're going to do a half strike to the chin. So if you recall yung upward strike natin kanina, sa double stick pattern, dito lang tayo, half strike. We just mark the chin, meaning iiwan mo lang dyan, and then a circular strike to the top of the head using your wrist. Going back to Serada. So, ang itsura niyan is 1, 2. Okay? So, ang target niyan is the head, 1, 2, the chin, and then the head again. So, four movements na yan. Let's try that. Ready, and doblete. Half strike, circular strike. One more. Doblete. Half strike, circular strike. Good. One more. Doblete. Half strike, circular strike. Sapa, move, doblete, 
half strike, circular strike. From here, we're going to do a downward diagonal strike, similar to the second strike of the equis, and shift back to forward stance. So dito tayo, all the way here. Move, doblete, half strike, circular strike, downward strike. Again, so the entire five, five, ano na yan, na? five strikes. Ready, and move. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, see, it's a One, two, three, four, and five. From there, the next set, <coughs> we're going to step forward with the left leg. Okay? Kind of like walking now. Ganun lang. Okay? At the same time, yeah, doblete. <coughs> One, two. Yeah, it's a Yun lang muna, yung step with the doblete. Move, doblete. Come back. Move, doblete. One more. Move. From here, we're going to do what we call a pilantic. So, wrist movement siya, wrist strikes. Okay? So, it's sure from this position, you're going to flick it to the left and then flick it to the right. Yan, wrist movements. One, two. Both strikes are to the top of the head. <clears throat> so, let's try to get that movement muna. One, two. One, two. One, two. Okay, let's combine them. So again, right leg forward. Okay, so doblete, step forward. Yan. From this position, yung doblete. One, two. Yan. Isa pa? From here, from here lang. One, two. Okay, come back. Okay. Doblete, pilante. Then from here, we're gonna close with a downward strike to the head. Yan. Isa pa? Ready and move. Doblete. Half circular, downward strike, doblete, pilantic, downward strike. So the whole thing, pag mabilis siya, it looks like this. Yeah. So that's the entire routine. So one more, ready? Ready and doblete, half strike to the chin, come back with a circular strike, downward strike, all the way to abierta. Step forward, doblete ulit. Pilantic, to the left, to the right. And then, downward strike. Okay, so that's our set. So we'll close the session. Tan? Anda sa pugay, anda? Pugay! So, coach, yung palayan nyo, ano? Yes. Actually, mahirap siya sa una, pero pag nakuha man yung mga flow, hmm. sarap siya gawin, ha? Diba? Sarap. Ano masabi mo sa ginawa niya, coach? Medyo, <laughs> gano'n siya kalapit na sa pinakita mo kanina? Pwede na. Lahat <laughs> pa? Malapit-lapit naman. I mean, first session din naman uh -huh. natin, uh -huh. diba? Uh -huh. Things to... <laughs> Alam mo yung tayo kambal, eh. <laughs> Things to keep in mind kapag nag-execute ng, or nag-retraining para sa mm -hmm. kanyang coach. Um, siguro, kasi in comparison to combat, mm. dito talaga may emphasis talaga on really executing it in a certain <coughs> way. Kasi it's all about form, talaga. it's all about grace. Mm. So, important talaga mag-practice again and again. I mean, mm. just like the basics, diba? Pero nakakatulong din when you have a mirror. Kasi mm. nakikita mo, meron ka ng feedback agad. Mm. Or you can also take your own video, mga ganun. Ayun. So, yun. Um, practice talaga and really just making sure it looks and feels right. So, mm -hmm. Alright. Maraming maraming salamat, Coach salamat din. Daniel Bernas, mga kapatid. Sa next, susunod na episode ng Usapang Arisa, ano bang tuturo natin sa kanila? Ah, tignan natin. Hindi ko pa sure. Oh, oh. Basta marami <laughs> yan. Ito yung programa tungkol sa Pinoy na Pinoy na martial art. Talagang sariling atin to. Yes. Mga kapatid, ako po si Lord Vera. Ako po si Arvick Tan. At ako si Daniel Bernas. Sabay-sabay po tayong humataw dito sa Usapang, Usapang Arisa. Arisa.